Hi, how are you? So I thought it would be interesting to read a story that I wrote for a college literary journal. But rather than just reading it out loud, I thought it was time for me to try some ASMR. For a better listening experience, you may want to put on some headphones. So here it goes. The Man That Was, a short story by Shannon Solange. I don't know his name or where he came from. I only know that I had never seen a man as humble as that before in my life. He was sitting on a broken surfboard along the deserted beach next to his little white poodle, staring at the murky waters in front of him. Behind him was a forest of palm trees. The only object in the bay was a tiny paint-chipped sailboat, which must have belonged to him. He was a skinny middle-aged man, but he seemed full of vitality, not weak in any sense. He told me he had been sailing all over Europe before arriving at this tropical island. His only companion was his fluffy white friend. You'd think he would be lonely, but he seemed utterly content with his current situation. Relaxing on the beach, enjoying life. Did he look for companionship when he was ashore? I don't know, but it didn't seem to matter. He told me he wanted to free himself from the responsibilities that keep most people bound to the ground. That kind of lifestyle did not make him happy. So there he was, sailing away from everything he knew, free from any obligations. One day, I didn't see him on the beach anymore. Later that week, I went to town. I saw his sailboat docked in the harbor. He probably stocked up on groceries before continuing his journey into the unknown. That was the last time I ever saw his boat. I wondered where he might have gone and if he would ever settle down somewhere. Could anyone truly be happy living an unattached, lonesome life? Some days I wish I had joined him on that sailboat. I want to see more of the world and I want to experience the kind of freedom he spoke of. The kind of freedom that most don't even dare dream about. I never understood how he could be so happy. And I guess I never will find out. That secret sailed away with him that day. But not a day goes by that I do not wonder if that could have been me. Thank you for listening. I hope this story inspired you. And who knows, maybe the ASMR even put you to sleep a little bit. But anyway, life is an experiment, so here you go. And don't forget to tune in for my next video because I will keep bringing you crazy adventures. Ciao.